Well, another two day gap in between videos. My bad. But I got some parts. The rest of my engine parts for the uh, for the long block assembly. Um, not sure when the part is sit here for a while. But uh, yeah, so what it is is it's push rods, lifters, and the Trunnion upgrade kit for the LS. Uh, on top of that, I built up my new frame. Some of you guys might have seen it online. It's the uh, it's a Stranger frame, but it's the Quan JZ frame. Um, I don't have any money to go ride right now. Hopefully, my uh, money shows up in the mail soon because uh, my royalties from from the last frame. Once those show up, I'll have some money to go ride and uh, pay for gas and more car parts. Hopefully, but the bike looks great. I really enjoy it. It's got a lower standover, shorter back end. Seems great. Got a little Jay Z right there. My focus. Got a little Jay Z right there. Ah, big Jay Z here. Focus. Boom. Got it. So, nothing too crazy going on today. But if you guys haven't seen already, see how the guys just fucking. These nerds bought a WRX. The car's sick, dude. Thank you. Look at the wing, dude. Can your, can oh, your camera see the wing? Maybe. Oh. Yeah, I can, dude. Look Chow, at shut the hell up. Yo, Caleb, you want to fight? Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Dude, so dirty. Hey, but look at how sick. Yeah, because it's got fucking dirt on it from yeah, rallying. Literally in Mexico, WRC. He was racing with Ken Block. Yeah. Ken Block drove uh, this wing. Yeah. Just the, the wing. Yeah, the wing came off Ken Block's car. Yeah. JK, it didn't. Uh, I see his signature. Oh, uh, yeah. KB, <laughs> Kelly Blue Book, <laughs> KBB, but uh, so Orion might have jumped this car on accident on purpose. Yep, on purpose. And, totally. and when he did it. that though, it kind of like tweaked the front end. We're not sure where it got tweaked, but the hood is is a it's a VIS hood, and the hood doesn't sit flush anymore. So he's decided to put hood pins on it to help hold down this corner. Yeah, here, you know what? Oh wait, no, we can't even. No, nah, let's just leave it up right now. Like when you shut the hood fully and it's latched and going nowhere, there's like. The hood is like elevated like two or three inches past the fender line. Yeah. And it looks retarded. So we'll throw a hood pin in here and then have to get it to where like you push the hood down and then put the pin in and that'll hold it down nice and tight. He's going to leave the latch too just for extra. Extra support, dude. I don't yeah. want this shit flying off on me. I think I'm getting sick again, dude. I'm sick of getting sick. Okay, so basically everything you need for hood pins is uh, AutoZone hood pins. Six bucks. Six bucks. They're honestly the best. I've ran them on every car. Um, they work best though if you have like a uh, piece of like not wire. What would you call it? Like uh, what do you mean? Basically, you have to have a leash for your oh, pin. Oh, for the pin, so it doesn't you fucking go flying. You want to have a leash for your pin. That way, you don't forget to put the pins back in when you uh, go out on track or go for a drive on the street. Um, we got a 19 wrench. We've got a drill. And uh, this is where they're gonna sit. So we're gonna make sure they line up with this spot right here. This is a uh, aftermarket hood, so we want to make sure. And there's a crack right here, so. Oh, there's two cracks then, because there's also a crack on this side. Somewhere. Should be fine, because it's gonna go out the top. We're gonna make sure it lines up, and then drill some holes. I can't wait to see how these hood pins come out. Why yeah. would they not come out good? <laughs> because Caleb's ruining everything. Oh, that's shots, Caleb. Chow hates you. I know. Yeah. He wants to eat your dog. <laughs> <laughs> Offended. You always joke about it though, so. <laughs> about eating my dog? Yeah, he's like, Carlos. Carlos! He'll look at Carlos and he'll be like, I have candy, Carlos. He's literally, he's like coming up to you now too. Alright, I'm drilling a hole. Right. You know where it's going. Yeah. Alright, film Caleb drill this hole so if it gets One fucked up, we blame Caleb. Caleb. Up, man. Here, look under there. Turn that a little bit. Uh -huh. I'm gonna go put this shit. Just commit. Uh, so look, it's like right on the Drill crease. it from the top. Yeah. No, no, yeah, yeah, I, see, I see. I see how you're no, doing it, and it's not a bad method. We'll see. Yeah. Horrible yeah. method. No, because it's only it only goes in one spot. I can't see anything. Oh, that looks like it's going through like butter. Woo! Don't get that, don't breathe that in. I'm trying not to, I'm trying to see. You need the light on top or the bottom? It's through. Have we penetrated? We have penetrated. Let's see if it lines up. Nope. Fuck you, Chow, you bitch ass motherfucker. Chow! You're a bitch ass. <laughs> Yo, get the straight out of my <laughs> you are a bitch ass motherfucker! <laughs> Look at that. That's exactly what we're looking to do right there. Yeah, but we're gonna try and. Yeah, no, we have to like, yeah, we have to line it up. Well, it's not even left. Yeah, yeah. 
It's pretty much done. This needs to go down. Yeah, well, it's going to. Yeah, trust me, it's going to. Yeah, see how good that was? First try. How low is yours? This one's pretty low. Like, that's no, how much thread no, remains. Well, we can, we can take the motor to the shop. We can put the flywheel on, put the clutch on. Yeah. Um, if you guys don't know, these are Caleb's family. Uh, yeah, these are Caleb's. That side's going to have to go real low. <laughs> Daddy. Yeah. Caleb, Caleb is dad. Caleb's yeah. father. Yeah. Caleb's a bitch, yeah. We, no, we, we, <laughs> Said it, I, dude, know. I know, dude. He'd be talking that shit on and off the camera. I'm serious. <laughs> Got it. Got it. All right. <laughs> Caleb's confident. Where's the drill? Next year. Oh, he just, he's just going in. <laughs> What's the matter? He's like filming <laughs> with both cameras like behind your head. How do you think yeah. they get those awesome shots in the pornos? Like that? Yeah. By the way, Kilo got a fat head. <laughs> oh, dude, that's the money. That's the money, dude. Two for two. Yeah. That's why we came here. Caleb's the hood pin, man. Dude. I'm, I'm Kilo's good? biggest fan. Oh, bitch slap you on my fucking channel. That'll be my intro. This is how he treats his fan. You see this? Caleb is like my fan. This is racist. This is racist. You see all these white people trying to beat me up? <laughs> Hood pin, success. It's hot. It's fucking hot as shit out here. Yeah. But uh, you have to fasten the headlight on that side. Yeah, I'll get that, but that's good looking. Yeah, it looks Looks dope. race car too. Goes with the whole rally theme. Now we got a giant wing. Got uh -huh. some hood pins like that actually help the car. Yeah. It definitely helped all the body lines. Yeah. Like, dude, this gap was unbearable to look at. Like, this shit was, was okay, like, so up like, here. it was like this high. Yeah, it was horrifying. So once the headlights tighten up, it won't look like that, but. Well, I'm worried about Chow eating my dog. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you guys don't know what happens off camera. Chad talks about eating cats and dogs all the time. Yo, he does it on camera too, dude. He doesn't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. He literally wants to One eat One day, your Carlos dog. will come with me, and that's the last of him. To his mom's Chinese restaurant. <laughs> your mom has a Chinese restaurant? No. Yeah, she does. <laughs> she have a fucking sweatshop, so it's gonna. Ah, dude, she, has love, she has a massage parlor. I love when Chow cracks jokes against his own people, and he says the funniest shit. I still BMX like BMX for life. All right, we got the hood pins all dialed in. Now we're inside oh, yeah, watching really the Pro 2, a top 16 at Evergreen. My boy Dylan Hughes, this is his first round of Pro 2 this year. He just had a super good lead run, and now he's going to chase this dude from another country. And uh, I am going to go ahead and assume that Dylan is going to win this battle because he's a fucking badass. Let's watch him. All right, here we go. Dylan's in the gray coupe. Out front. Here we go. Dylan Hughes. Giving chase, initiating. So, oh, oh that guy's done. Dylan moves on. There he goes. A big hit by Sylvester Gorgi. That's my dog. Does not Comment below right now who you guys think is going to win Pro 2. Because it happened in front of him. A lot of good drivers. This is my home track. Wish I was there. Rooting everybody on. All right, well, we finished watching Pro 2. Two Pacific Northwest drivers on the podium. Matt Van Kirk in first. Dylan Hughes in second. And Dirk Stratton in third. Dirk Stratton definitely has my favorite car in Pro 2. It's fucking sick. It's a C6 um, with a bunch of interior. I'm not really an interior guy, but it's a sick car. Um, I thought I was going to film more today. I really try and make these videos about 10 minutes long. And I might fail to do that for this video, but at least it's something. <coughs> uh, Orion and me have been talking about doing something this weekend. All goes well. It's going to be a fucking crazy video. That's for damn sure. Some other stuff going on is I want to do a Q&A with Quentin and DJ for more skids. Those are two of my very good friends. I miss them a lot. And uh, I know you guys like them, so maybe we'll do that. Do not ask your questions on this video, but I will make sure to let you know on Instagram when we're gonna do that, so make sure to follow me on Instagram. It's at Caleb Quanbeck. Uh, I don't even know what to say about the car. This thing has to come out. This is just a uh, test block. I have to pull this and the transmission out. I do have the parts to finish assembling my engine, except for I don't know how to do it. So it's whenever Tom has time, and as far as right now, 
it doesn't look like he's going to have any time soon to work on my car. The Haggard car is here. That has to get done ASAP. Um, they're getting a cage. This thing has to be finished and get out of the shop. And uh, yeah, it just doesn't really seem like it's uh, it's going to happen anytime soon. It's very unfortunate, but it is what it is. Still trying to find a place to move into down here. It's definitely been difficult. But, to say the least, the car is further along now than it has been since I got it. So i got to try and stay positive somehow. At least I got a brand new fucking bike and I got Carlos. Carlos, do you love me? Come here. Give me a hug. Come here. Come here. Can I have a hug? Come on. Yes. See, he loves me. Try to kiss this. So at least I have Carlos, and at least I have this brand new bike. So, if more of you guys would watch my BMX stuff that I put out, that would be sick. Um, but if you don't, whatever, I'm still just going to go ride, because it'll keep my mind busy. So enough with the rant and just talking about fucking nothing. We got the hood pins in on Orion's WRX. They got a new trunk with a wing, and uh, hopefully we'll be doing a video this weekend with that car, doing something wild. So make sure to subscribe, comment. Turn the notification button on. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.